report a killing. All right, sir, tell me the nature of the killing and the captain will be with you I shortly. I killed a girl and she's out in the car in front. Tom Cordry, Stanford sophomore, Eagle Scout, captain of the Stanford ROTC. So you tell my secretary that you killed a girl. That's right. And you come to confess? I was able to resist them all until this time. Who, Tom? Them. Woman. They're just so beautiful, you know. Fragile, soft. I don't know, I can't explain it. And the dead girl outside, who was she? Dina Bond. And who is Dina Bond? How do you know her? She went to high school in Palo Alto. Went on a date with her a couple times at the movies. Told her I needed a favor. What favor? Well, obviously there wasn't one. Look, Tom, I just need to know what happened from the beginning for the record. For the record? That morning I purchased a 22 caliber rifle and ammunition for the purpose of picking up a girl, killing her, raping her, and leaving her body in the hills. In what order? In that order. I tried finding a victim. It's hard, you know, finding the right girl for your first time. At 10 p.m. I went back home and called Dina. Dina. Oh, hey, Tom. I had a really good time at the drive-in last week. Yeah, me too. But why are you calling so late? You could have woke my parents up. Do you know what time it is? I know, but I need a favor. You see, I left my car by the train station, and I need to get it for an interview I've got lined up for tomorrow. I don't know. You know my parents don't like me driving alone late at night. Besides, if they wake up and I'm not here... You won't be by yourself. I'll be there with you. Well... Well? She came right over. And then you killed her. Patience. A gentleman just doesn't rush into things. Where's the romance in that? Look, Tom, I don't know what kind of sick game you're playing here, but if you think you can get away with this murder on the virtue of whatever convinced you to come in and turn yourself in, you're wrong. Come on, Captain. Do you want my confession or what? Because, according to the record, I haven't officially told you I've murdered anyone. As I was saying, when she came over, I told her I needed to head it over to the ROTC building to return my rifle. Since she wasn't too familiar with campus, I told her I drive. We headed out into the hills behind Lake Log. I took her out to the woods. At first she was confused. Then she tried pleading for her life. It was ugly, it really was. At that point, her all night to die. And you mentioned you intended on raping this girl? Did you sexually assault Dina Bond? No. You expect me to believe that after all you've told me here? That you didn't sexually assault her? I didn't. Well, Tom, I've got enough on the record to put you away for a long time. Captain Salt, don't you want to know why I didn't rape her? She was just too beautiful, Captain. She looked like an angel. Peaceful. Pure. I couldn't touch her after that. I didn't deserve her. She was just so goddamn beautiful. I made a mistake. I'm ready to face it. I'll never make it again. Well, Tom, I wouldn't expect a killer like you to have a conscience. The killing wasn't the mistake, Captain. Neither was turning myself in. You see, Captain? Beauty like that shouldn't exist in this world. I'll never kill again because, no matter what I do, nothing will equal what I felt that night. I realized something out there in the woods with Dina. Something I'll never be able to escape. And what was that? That's something that can't be put on the record. <laughs>